I think we both were kind of blown away by the care we got at Ascension St. Thomas. We had multiple nurses, Dr. Clendenin, everyone we saw, even the pediatrician who just took really good care of our family and of our boys. And I think we're just grateful for kind of the compassion we felt for the crazy situation we were going through. <laughs> It's been insanity how much life has changed, having three little baby boys come in. Like we skipped a lot of stages <laughs> of life and we just went right to like the full big family. So this is Brisbane Lee Flom. This is Lachlan James. And this is Wilder Scott. Oh, see, that's cute Brizzy boy. In the ultrasound and I'm like, okay, I see a baby. This is really, really good. And all of a sudden the ultrasound tech just goes quiet. And she was like, did you guys know? And we were like, oh yeah, we did a blood test. We know it's a boy, like it's fine, you can show us. And she was like, no, 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 no. Did you know there's multiples? I knew it. I like had this feeling, I was like, it's twins, isn't it? It's twins. And then she says the words that will forever be in our mind of, I'm still counting. So Emerson is our little girl. She has been really sweet. She's super motherly with the boys, wants to help. Triplets in general are not extremely common and, and she had what we call spontaneous triplets which means no, no intervention, no in vitro fertilization, no specialist. She just got pregnant spontaneously with three healthy babies. We had a miscarriage between Emerson and the boys that was a surprise pregnancy so it was kind of emotional whiplash for us then God decided to really just <laughs> give us three rainbows give, <laughs> give us three rainbow babies we work in conjunction with the maternal fetal medicine group they are always in communication with us so Wilder was in the NICU for nine days. He was unable to breathe on his own, so he was on oxygen for about seven of those days. So every concern that I expressed was met with like an explanation or compassion, whatever I needed in that moment. Rachel was actually planning a home birth with this pregnancy until she found out she had, had was diagnosed with triplets. I think what was great to me about Dr. Clendenin, he'll give his opinion. He'll tell you why he thinks you should do this or that, and then he'll let you process, and then he'll respect whatever decision you come to. And Dr. Clendenin is a very calming spirit. Oh my gosh, yeah. Thinking about the procedure and all that stuff, I'd get a little queasy. But then all of a sudden, the moment he came into the room and he's like, okay, so this is the situation. So I'm like, great, let's do it. Jordan um, has uh, told me I'm now part of the family. And so I specifically said that I will be there for Thanksgiving and I will be there for Christmas dinner. I think it's gonna be a lasting relationship. Mm -hmm.